If you can create the illusion of a scar with no sutures, why would you not? The intradermal or subcuticular suture. You anchor the suture deep inside the wound. A surgeon's knot followed by two reef knots. You cut the suture flush with the skin. You don't want to see the knot. You now run the suture intradermally, also known as subcuticular, so the suture is invisible through the epidermis. Mount the suture straight away. Go in opposite where you came out. You stay as superficial as possible without seeing the suture pierce the epidermis. Mount it straight away. Go in opposite where you came out. You now need to anchor the knot on the other side. Take a bite deep. Create a loop and leave a long suture with the needle on on the other side. The Aberdeen knot. This is a buried knot. You keep the loop over your thumb and index. You keep the needle on the opposite side. Sweep the long suture through the loop. You pull the under thread until the knot slides down into the wound. Do not let the needle come through the loop just yet. Recreate the loop. Bring the long suture through the loop. Pull the lower suture till the knot slides down. Repeat this step four to six times. Once you've recreated all your knots, bring the needle through the loop. need to bury the suture. Take a bite in the apex and come out. Give it a tug. And cut flush with the skin. 